Hello everyone. Today we'll discuss the GSM and GPS modem or module interfacing with the controller. There are different GSM modules. For example, SIM 900, SIM 800. GSM uses RS-232 interface or protocol for communication with computer. It uses AT commands to interact with the computer. The features or the services that are supported by the GSM module are voice call, SMS, data or fax and the GPRS based services. There is an inbuilt TCP IP protocol stack for in internet data transfer over the GPRS. The GSM modem requires a SIM card. GSM modules can support four different frequency bands 850 MHz, 900 MHz, 1800 MHz and 1900 MHz. GSM modules that supports two different frequency bands so those are dual band models. The frequencies are 900 and 1800 MHz. Now let's see the comparison between SIM 800L and SIM 900A GSM models. The supply voltage ranges from 3.4 volt to 4.4 volt. Both the models support four different frequency bands. The cellular network supported is 2G. There is an audio input output facility available in both the models. The services provided are SMS, GPRS and FM. The transmit power is 2 Watt for GSM 850 and 1 Watt for DCS 1800. Both the modules use AT command to communicate with the controllers. The antenna used in SIM 800L is FL connector and in SIM 900A is UFL and SMA connectors. Both the modules use SIM card. SIM 800L is the new module so it supports the Bluetooth and FM while SIM 900A is the old module it does not support the Bluetooth. GSM uses RS-232 standard or protocol to communicate with the computers. So this is RS-232 DB9 connector. Pin number 2 is received data and pin number 3 is transmitted data. GSM also uses the AT commands to interact with the computer. AT is the abbreviation for attention. AT commands are used to access following information and the services. Configuration of modem and SIM, SMS services, MMF services, fax services and the GPRS based services. The table shows the different AT commands used in GSM interfacing. For example, AT. It is used to check the communication between the module and the computer. AT plus CMGF equals to 1. This command is used to select the SMS mode. AT plus CMGS to send the messages. And ATH is used to hang up the call. There are many AT commands that are used by the GSM module to communicate with the computer or the controller. A figure shows the interfacing of GSM module with the controller. Here there are only three pins used. The transmit pin of controller is connected with the received pin of GSM module. Then received pin of controller is connected with the transmit pin of GSM module and the ground pin of controller is connected with the ground pin of GSM module. Here the Arduino will have its own 12 volt 2 ampere DC input. Similarly the GSM module will have its 12 volt 2 ampere DC input. So this is a very simple interfacing diagram wherein only three pins are used to connect controller with the GSM module. Figure shows the peak 18 f controller connected with the GSM module. In the interfacing diagram only three pins are used. Now let us see the GPS module. GPS module gives output in standard National Marine Electronics Association string format. It provides output serially on transmit pin with default 9600 baud rate. NMEA string contains different parameters such as longitude, latitude, altitude and time. Each string starts with the dollar symbol. Now let us see the different pins of GPS model. So we have VCC, power supply. So it operates around 3.3 to 5 volt. Then ground pin, TX transmit data serially which gives information about location, time, 
RX receive data serially, it is required when we want to configure GPS module. Figure shows the interfacing of GPS module with controller. Here the TX pin of controller is connected with the RX pin of GPS module. RX pin of controller is connected with the TX pin of GPS module. Ground is connected with the ground and the VCC of controller is connected with the VCC pin of GPS module. The Arduino board is connected with the GPS module. So again there are four pins used TX, RX, VCC and ground. Now here is an example of NMEA string format. The same string format we can observe on the computer. So this was all about the interfacing of GSM and GPS module with the controller. Thank you everyone.